Hi everyone, this is Tim from milehighthemes.com and today we're going to run through the header navigation and how to create mega menus in the Galleria theme. So we're going to quickly do a little header deconstruction on our demo store here so I can show you the different options we have enabled and how you can set this up yourself. So first of all, you can see that we have our header here with our logo in the center. And then we've got a couple of different mega menus here with some images on the right. So our shop and our featured menu, this one has four columns, this one two. Then we've got a standard drop down menu just for testing on this lookbook. And then a couple of other items here. So let's jump into the settings and take a look at how this is set up. So I'm in my online store themes area within Shopify and I'm gonna go ahead and customize the Galleria theme. And most everything we're gonna be looking at tonight is in this header link here. So first of all, if I just click on the word header, I get sort of the main settings for the header. So this is where we've added our logo. We've got some width and text color background options overlapping the images behind the header if you like that, or you can make it standalone if you want. Um, and then there's some other options for the header in here. If we back out of here, there's a couple of different block options for the header. So if we click add block, we can choose a menu or a mega menu. So a menu is just going to be like a standard group of menus like this with drop down menus if we have nesting and then a mega menu is obviously this multi-column menu. So in this case, in this header, we have shop, we have featured, and then we have a main menu that's just making up these other four links. So if I click on shop, you'll see that it's a mega menu, and we just specify a menu for just this one link to populate this. The word, the text is shop, so that's the text that is populated up here. And you can specify a link for that. So if you click on this word shop, then it will take you to your all collections page. And this is where you add the images that will appear on the right side of the menu here. So you can add the image, some text, and a link here. So that takes care of the shop menu. And then we have a featured menu here. If we click on that. It's using a separate menu called Mega Nav Featured. And then the text is obviously the heading text here again. And there's the image that we have. We're only showing one image on this one because we have four columns in here. And then the new main menu is just showing a menu called New Main Menu that just populates the rest of the main navigation. Now, if you did have second level navigation on any of these items. It would show a standard drop down like I showed you earlier. It actually already deleted that. But you can have just static links like this or you can have single column drop downs in your menu. So with that out of the way, we're gonna jump over into the menus themselves just to see how these are set up. So again, with the shop menu, we're using a menu called Mega Menu. For the featured, we're using Mega Nav Featured. So I'm going to go ahead and exit out of here and I'm going to go to online store navigation and you can see the different menus we have here. So mega menu, you can see that we've got two different menus in here with nested menu items below. So I'm not going to go into a lot of detail about how to create menus because there's a lot of tutorials on Shopify on how to do that, but it's very easy. Um, you basically just create menu items and um, you type in here, put in a link and add it. Then you can drag them and drop them around. And if you want to make them nested, you can drag them slightly to the left or right and they, you'll see the indentation over here adjust to show that it's part of this menu. So this is the mega menu with two columns. So we'll take a look, that is the shop menu here, shop by type, shop by device, and then all the links below that. So we've got all the links below shop by type and all the links below shop by device. And then we have the other menu, which is Mega Nav Featured. And you can see that there are four options in this. So you've got a four column mega menu. And the theme is smart enough to know that 
if you have four items in here, it will show four columns across. If you have three, it will show three, and so on. And then, of course, you've just got nested navigation below these headings, staff picks, customer favorites, top gifts ideas, editor's choice. So we've got staff picks, customer favorites, top gift ideas, and editor's choice with all the links below that. So that's a quick and dirty rundown of the header options that come with Galleria. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to our support team. We'd be happy to help. Thank you so much for watching this video and for trying out our themes. We really appreciate it, and we'll see you in the next one.